I used to have my head down low, never knowing which way I was going. My life was getting close to the edge, and I knew that it was showing because of you. I can stand and hold my head up high because of you. I feel free, and yet I don't know. There's a springtime song with the sun up in the sky The sadness that is on your face Help me to realize I owe each day I have to you And I'll pay you back someday You're reading me like a book But I really would like to say So this song is titled Because of You, and it's written by Chris Rio, and was released back in 1978. I wanted to do this song as a tribute to some of the great musicians that we have lost through the years, local musicians in Singapore, you know, that, that played an important part in my life. Um, I remember when I was 17 years old, uh, waiting to go to the army. We, we, we have a two-year stint in the army. For, it's a compulsory thing for all Singaporeans. At the age of 18, we we'll, were we'll going to the army for two years. At the age of 17, I was like hanging around, you know, waiting to go in. And I, I used to hang around with my friends at uh, some of the pubs, clubs in Singapore, you know, with live bands. And one of the bands that I was a fan of was Western Union Band. And the frontman, right, uh, the lead guitarist was this guy called Chris Vatham. And I was like, you know, um, going to the clubs uh, most days just to watch the band. And Chris is a phenomenal player and, and a great singer. Um, and he was the one that, uh, that made me want to get a Les Paul, because he was playing a Les Paul. And he was the one who, who made me, 
you know, just spurred me on. You know, I, I didn't have a chance to talk to him, but just watching him play, you know, it's just inspiration by itself. Um, uh, sadly, he passed away a couple of years back in London. And uh, yeah, we just lost one of the, uh, the gems, you know, the musical gems in Singapore. And uh, of course, there's this other guy called uh, Reggie Verges, a you know, great producer and a great session guitar player. And he was he produced a whole lot of local albums um, back in the uh, in the 80s, all true, uh, to you know the 90s. Uh, in, th in fact, I think it was like in the mid 70s he started producing a lot of albums, uh, albums by Tracy Huang and uh, um, West Union Band, Matthew and the Mandarins, Tanier. You know Tony Terry and Spencer, and he, he was at the forefront of all these albums, and he was a great producer, you know, and a great guitarist. You know, he can, he can, he can actually play all those parts that we hear, and we can only hope to play. And he was doing it, uh, you know, in the studio. And he was, he was, he was one of those guys that 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 really inspired me to be a, a studio musician. And of course, the other guy is Steve Lukather, uh, which I've been following many years. You know, but Reggie, you know, he's. He's a character, but you know, his his musicality, his musicianship is incomparable, un right? Uh, the other guy uh, that I want to give tribute to is Martin Perella, another great session guitar player, incredible uh, acoustic guitar player, as well as electrical, uh, as well as electric guitar. You know, he 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 does open tunings and he, he does great open tunings, and he's so articulate and very precise and very melodic you know and he's he was one of the the main uh, session guitarists uh, in those days you know back in the uh, the late 70s all the way down to uh, mid 2000 you know and also we lost him to cancer a couple of years back and um, yeah I worked with him a couple of times you know and I always remembered him being so kind to me because I asked him questions and he he, he kind of like encouraged me and and taught me certain, certain stuff, knowing the fact that I'm a guitarist because I was engineered and I was recording him. So, uh, yeah, he's a great guy, you know. Um, um, the other guy that I really want to give tribute to uh, is the late Iskander Ismail. Um, I know Iskander um, uh, when, I, when I first played in the club, and he was the one who gave me the chance to be a studio musician um, back in 19... I don't know, 1980, 85, 86, you know. Um, and I owe a debt to this man. You know, he was the one who brought me into this uh, uh, this career, you know. And um, I could never repay him for the things that he has done for me, for his friendship, for his mentorship. And um, yeah, I, I miss him. I, I do miss him every time. I think of him, you know, I just remember the way he smiled, the way he talks. And we, we, we worked uh, for many times, we, we worked many times together in, in concerts as well as in recording projects. And I can never, never forget his infectious laughter. Right? Uh, the reason why I'm doing this song was because um, this song was a, a, a song taken from an album by Tanya. You know, and um, back in well, I think I guess it's back in 1980, 80ish, and uh, Tanya consists of a lot of musicians, but the front man is this guy called Zo Salton. And sadly, Zo uh, passed away in December on December the fifth. And I, I remembered I was so heartbroken when I heard the news, because I managed to have some time with him at uh, the wake of Reggie Verges, and we spoke for a while, and uh, he came across as intelligent guy and you know really compassionate and really really passionate about his music as well as uh, giving encouragement to younger musicians and I told him that you know he was the one who turned me on to Boss Gags because of this song um, Georgia uh, it was featured in the album in the, in the, in the, in the solo album and yeah and he's also one of the few real few gems in Singapore that uh, we lost in these recent years so yeah I just want to give a shout out to these guys because they're, they're instrumental in, uh, in my career in what I do and I'm sure not just to me to a lot of musicians 
and I'm I, I'm sure that it inspired and have touched many musicians, local musicians, you know, along the way. So um, yeah, so I hope you enjoy this song, uh, and uh, if it reminds you of someone else that uh, has encouraged you or inspired you, you know, give a second of thought to them, you know, just remember them by. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to this channel if you want to. And I'll see you in a bit. So in the meantime, take care. Ciao.